Hey, you're not gonna believe how easy it is to get fantastic audio quality in Premiere Pro. In fact, it only takes a few clicks. So let's jump right in, I'll show you how you can do it. Okay, so right now we are in Premiere Pro. I've recorded a sound sample using the built-in microphone on my laptop. So let's just hear how it sounds. Hey, what's up everybody? Today I'm gonna show you how you can get fantastic audio quality in Premiere Pro. So this is the raw audio. It has no, no editing whatsoever. So right now I'm gonna show you how you can just, in a few clicks, you can improve the audio quality. So I'll just, duplicate the audio sample over here. And what's next? You just click this workspaces icon on the top right corner here and choose audio. It will change the workspace to audio setup. So what you want to have in this audio workspace is actually this essential sound. Uh, you can also get this essential sound by clicking window and make sure that the essential sound is ticked. So right now, in order to use this essential sound feature here, you need to highlight the sound sample here. And depending what you want the sound to be, uh, this is like a tagging. So in this case, it's, a, it's a more like a dialogue. So I'll click dialogue. And you can just simply use the preset here. In my case, I will use a balanced male voice. And that's it in literally just a few clicks. I believe it's less than five clicks, okay? So let's hear how, how it sounds compared to the previous one. Hey, what's up everybody? Today I'm gonna show you how you can get fantastic audio quality in Premiere Pro. Hey, what's up everybody? Today I'm gonna show you how you can get fantastic audio quality in Premiere Pro. So you can hear that the audio is much more clearer because it's much louder. Uh, but at the same time, you can also hear the background voice also being boosted. So there is a settings here you can play around with. In my case here, it's under this uh, repair tab. You open it up, click it once to open it up and just tick reduce noise. And let's hear it again. Hey, what's up everybody? Today I'm gonna show you how you can get fantastic audio quality in Premiere Pro. Hey, what's up everybody? Today I'm gonna show you how you can get fantastic audio quality in Premiere Pro. Amazing, so you can clearly tell the difference with and without the reduce noise function. You feel free to try it out with different presets, it's amazing. And depending what kind of audio you wanna play around, you can choose if it's a music, you can use music. If it's a sound effects, you use SFX. If it's just like in ambience, of course you tag whatever that is relevant. With different kind of tags comes with different kind of settings. So feel free to play around. It's pretty intuitive. You can pretty much learn it as you play around with it. And the difference is pretty significant as you can see from this example here. I've not even gone into playing with the sliders, the parameters. All I did was just enable the reduced noise and the, and the result is pretty good to me. However, if you feel like you're in a much noisier environment and you would like to reduce the noise further, just simply slide it to the max. Like, let's hear how it sounds. Hey, what's up everybody? Today I'm gonna show you how you can get fantastic audio quality in Premiere Pro. Hey, what's up everybody? Today I'm gonna show you how you can get fantastic audio quality in Premiere Pro. There you go, like I said, the difference is huge, right? Just play around with the settings in this essential sound. Now, another thing about this essential that I like is that sometimes you get audios at different volumes. Like some people will speak a bit louder, some people will speak a bit softer, and you will always try to find the right balance and with this essential sound, it does everything for you. It will uh, analyze the track and make sure that everything's optimized to, uh, to the right level. So you don't always have to go to individual sound samples and make individual adjustments. You can just highlight all of them and do it all at once by just tagging them and, and select the right presets and so on. You can select multiple sound samples at the same time and apply a preset at one go. You don't really have to go into individual clips and make adjustments. You can do it all by selecting all the relevant clips at one go. 
So there you go, I hope that you learned a thing or two about this feature in Premiere Pro. I love it personally and I've been using it since day one. Now I hope you do as well. And as usual, if you like today's video, please click a like and don't forget to smash the subscribe button so you won't miss any of my future videos. And I'll see you in the next video.